Hi, and welcome to the Yarn Habit Geek Podcast. My name is Laura. You can find me on Facebook, Instagram, and Ravelry. As a Yarn Habit Geek, there is also a Ravelry group for the podcast if you wish to join and where you can uh, chatter for the Doctor Who Knit Along, which is coming up at the beginning of next month. Let's, so uh, let's get started with this week's episode, shall we? All right, whips of the week. So first one I'm going to show off is, um, it's not much done because, you know, I have a long loop to work on, but it is my Princess Serenity dress. I doubt I will have a finish for next month's um, Sailor Moon Pretty Heroes Convention, but you know what? It will eventually get done for me to wear a con. I don't really like um, having due dates for some of my costumes, unless, you know, I am desperately needing it for a certain con, for a certain photo op. But enough about my con chatter, because there's going to be con chatter during next week's episode. Alright, next up is something I finally got back to working on, and uh, I finally finished the back for my Molly Weasley new house coat. So obviously not much, but uh, the back was just my nightmare to work on, but I finished it just a day or two ago. So soon I get, so um, I'm going to soon cast on one of the front pieces. So I might end up working on that on the weekend or not, I don't know. I am planning on bringing one of my projects with me to work on the train on Saturday morning and uh, Sunday afternoon when I come back. But yay, the back is done on the house coat. And this is actually for her another cosplay I am doing. So two cosplay items <laughs> I was working on this week. But, um, let's get on to the next whip, which is another, which is weirdly, yeah, another Harry Potter, but um, themed item, which is another square dawn for the Ron Weasley blanket. I'm going to pop this in, in uh, along with the previous square I finished during the week and get on to another square. Although I might end up just bringing the squares to work on, on the train, since the Brown Weasley blanket is um, a really big project. And if I'm spacing out, it's probably because I'm just a little more excited because uh, you have heard me mentioning a train, it's because I'm going to Ottawa uh, this Saturday and coming back home on the Sunday. But here's the next whip. It is the Wicked Witch Sock. And I finished the heel. I actually finished the heel. I'm now on the part in which I get to work on the leg and cuff. And then I have one more of these socks to go. And then I can deliver them. Actually, if I can finish these socks before Enemy North, that would be awesome. But, you know what? I am, um, I'm not going to do some due dates, but just to finish this one sock. Michael will be amazing. And I am so happy I restarted this with better yarn. Or I should say better colored yarn. And it's also super soft. So yay. That is done for that. Oh! It looks like we have a guest. Say hello, everyone, to Kensington. Yes. I was not expecting you, Kensington. Say hi to everyone. Say hi to the podcast. Yeah. All right. He's going to go. And I'm going to get back to talking about the next two whips. 
And this one I finally got my work done on, which is the Red Hood sweater. And I am finally on the color work section. And I added another stitch marker to show me my halfway point so that way I can divide it between the front and back half so that way I know how uh, when to do or the uh, different changes in the yarn color. So that one will be staying home and not on coming with me on the train even though it needs more work. And lastly, even though I didn't worked in like maybe a few odd rows into it it is, I got, I got to get more work done on my Poison Ivy wrap. And I love the stitch work on this. This might get, this might be brought on the train. I don't know. I have to still decide what I'm bringing with me for my train ride. So that way I get to be kept occupied. So, and this was the last whip for the week. I am going to... Hopefully I will get uh, more done, but um, well, that's it for all my segments, and um, I will be back next week with some of my Ottawa adventure. Um, I am actually going to Ottawa for a con and delivering Billy Butcherson, who I finished, showed in last week's episode, and um, the Abe Sapien I finished last year or, along with uh, Hellboy that I brought with me to meet Guillermo del Toro. So uh, stay tuned for next week's episode where you get to see those pictures. Hopefully I get pictures but that is it. This was a sh pretty much a short episode because you know all I did was work on those whips and I was working on other stuff that wasn't knitting. And plus, I'm prepping for the con my one day at the con this weekend. So I will see you all next week. Hopefully, get more stuff done. Maybe a finished object. Who knows? But till then, stay crafty, my friends.